Welcome to Dr. Jester Rant, and I'm going to rant about people who do not seem to understand the lore and the importance of it, because then you would uh, tend to avoid making stupid mistakes like the guy who did this. If you're not familiar with it, uh, Fabius Bile, it's a character from Warhammer, and this is his miniature. You can see um, his medical stuff that he uses to torture people, to... Uh, extract stuff to actually enhance himself and, and craft stuff in his own body. So what we see here is a good example as to why you really, really need to know your lore. Because kind of frankly, the colors he is representing here kind of really properly represents um, what he is doing. I mean, I think if the person knew the lore... He would have used those colors. He would definitely have picked up another character to paint this. I think it's just a very good example of gatekeeping. You really need to gatekeep. Because, after all, stupidity has a bit of consequences in which people tend to mock it. And I mean really mock it because they know the lore. And you have it. It's MAM! Right. Mambile. Manbile. I think that would be the proper, proper definition. Even though he's possibly in the faction of Slanesh, but he doesn't seem to follow it, but still is a guy who tortures and do a lot of weird stuff. Here from Lexi Cannon. Fabius Bile, or in this version, Mam Bile. Here is what he said in early life. As a child, he learned the art of flesh crafting from one of his family's servants. Flesh crafting. Yeah, that's a good commentary to everything that is happening on the T of the alphabet. It's quite fascinating, these people. Really, you would think, of all the characters he could have picked, he picked this one. I think this is the best representation. I don't know if the, he's retarded or he doesn't really. But before I continue, here is a good trailer. that he is very much known is that he is a bit of a crazy scientist, kind of like a Mangala of the 20th, sorry, 31st millennium-ish, and then 41st millennium, because he kind of clones himself, uh, because his body is decaying, and everything he has in his body is kind of like uh, crafting, and, well, it's no one that his name kind of rhymes with vile, but anyway, here is one of the things that uh, Lexicanum says. Uh, to this end, Fabius began experimenting on both Emperor's children and blood angel blood and angels wounded or slain in war of on murder. 
This began Fabius' descent into corruption and madness as his experiments became ever more extreme. So basically, he, the guy who made this miniature, he painted this miniature here, he couldn't have picked up the the best, he couldn't have picked up, uh, how do I put it in English? He couldn't have chosen a better character to represent his, uh, his ideology. Basically, it fits to a T. And I'm pretty sure if it was a right winger who painted this, he would have been cancelled for transphobia. Let me put it this way, it's just that absurd. It, re it really is absurd, as absurd as it comes. I've never seen something this absurd with complete and total lack of self-awareness. Well, then again, this is a bunch of people who really, really completely lack self-awareness. Kind of like that meme you see on the internet, it's complete lack of self-awareness, and this is one, ladies and gentlemen, and other things. This is the best representation, but remember, considering that this subreddit is actually run by a bunch of crazy-ass idiots, you cannot and should not criticize them. You cannot even dis uh, disagree with it. You cannot and should not even even utter a single word or acronyms. Here is a good one. This is from uh, the same subreddit and the guy got banned. This guy over here. He posted on Horus Galaxy so you can see and this is the thread on Warhammer 40k. For a fabulous bile, that is all that's the post. Happy Pride. Yeah, Happy Pride. The best, best representation of it. Anyway, he posted SMH. SMH. And he literally got banned. Banned for those three little words. Talk about absurdity. But then again, this is the people who are really, really, really don't seem to understand their own law. These are the people who are so absolutely fucking insane that they actually lack the self-awareness of actually choosing this character. If he had any self-awareness left in his tiny little brain, he would literally have chosen something else, a new, a different character who doesn't pretty much kind of follows exactly what we have been saying about the T movement in the alphabet. He completely and totally lack the self-awareness. I mean, this meme here kind of fits perfectly for the man bile. Good God, this is why, this is why we must gatekeep. Morons like that very likely do not know the law. This is why we end up with idiots choosing things like that. So on that goddamn fucking hell, have a great fucking night and by God, this is pathetic. <laughs>